Hi, this is Jackie with the Build It All team. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to import a list from the old mailing boss to the new mailing boss. Now in this example, we are going to use the list old mailing boss list. We've got two subscribers and they've got some tags allocated. We're going to click on these little arrows to export that list. And you can choose either to click export right here or at the top right. I'm just going to click export here and click start export. Once the file has been exported successfully, it's going to show you here 100% completed. Please note that this is a CSV file and it's been added into a zip file. So you will need to go and unzip it and add it somewhere on your computer. In this example, I've already done that. So I'm just going to close it. Then we're going to go to the new mailing boss. In the new mailing boss, we're going to click import list structure. And then you need to go and look for the one that you are working with. So in this case, we know that it's the old mailing boss list. And we're going to click import. Now it says that the list has successfully been imported. Now we're going to click on subscriber import. And we are going to upload the CSV file. We're going to click on upload file. You're going to choose the file that you are working with. You're going to click open. You're going to note that they have been enabled. You can also enable additional fields if you want to. But in this case, we are just going to make sure that our tag internals is there. You're going to scroll down until you see import subscribers. You're going to click on that. Once it's been uploaded, you will see this little figurine thingy come up right here. And then we can hit close. And we're going to close. And then we're just going to refresh the page. And when you scroll to the bottom, you're going to see your list right there. And if I'm going to go to this little drop down and I'm going to go to the subscribers, we can check whether the tags has been added by just going to the update. And you're going to see the tags right here at the top. If you want to bring in a list from anywhere else, which was not the old mailing boss, you will just close that. And I'm just going to show you once you've imported your list. I'm just going to go through the process again. Right here at the bottom, you're going to see an example file that you can download. Just make sure that you've added the subscribers in the exact same format. And that's all about importing lists. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I'll see you in another.